All right, it's your boy Topsy, you're watching Source TV. We have got a very, very special guest for you here today. The one, the only, Jaquel Knight. How are you? What's happening? Thanks Thank you for having so, me. Thank you so much for taking time out of your busy schedule and coming down today. I've been trying to get this to happen for a long time now, but I'm really happy, happy you made it. Look, we're here, we're here, baby. Definitely. First and foremost, how are you finding London? You, you know, London's my second home. You yep. know, I really love the city. I love the energy. I love the architecture. I love the people. I love the food. Yep. You know, I love the um, street art. Yep. It's a great city. I'm having a blast. Came in town for Notting Hill Carnival. Oh, yeah, yeah. Which was crazy. Definitely. I was there, too. Literally the craziest thing I've ever been to in my entire life. Yeah, it's pretty, did you go on the Sunday or the Monday? Both. Both days, okay, fine. Yeah. yeah. Monday is definitely the slightly crazier day, but uh -huh. yeah, both days are definitely good. It was, I had a blast. Did you manage to get on a float as well, or you did? I was on the float. Nice. I was out in the middle of the people, you know, I was eating the Jamaican food. Yeah. I had a, yeah, I, I did a little bit of everything. 100%, yeah. that sounds good. It was a really good day. I guess first and foremost, uh, <laughs> really wanted to get to grips of why you got into dance in the first place. I guess that's a natural place to start. So I guess to start off with, how did that dance journey start and where? Um, you know, it's always rather interesting because I never saw myself being a dancer. You yeah. know, I just always knew I was going to end up being like a music producer of some sort. I was yeah. a musician first, um, played saxophone, ended up writing music for the high school band. And then my friend invited me to a workshop, you know, probably junior year of high school. And I think that workshop like changed my life. From there, I started a dance team in Atlanta called True Styles, oh, yeah. Dance Troop. Troop Styles. A, a True Styles, yep. yeah. T-R-U-S-T-Y-L-Z. Yeah. <laughs> With the and, Z on the end. Yeah. <laughs> and, um, we performed throughout the city of Atlanta. We was doing all the basketball games at the high school. Um, talent shows, celebrity events. And from there, you know, the networking started. People would ask, can you come do my video shoot? Can you be a part of this? Um, then I started to teach classes in the city and it's sort of this dance life has taken its own journey from there. It actually there. sort of flowed on flowed yeah. from there. Okay, and can you remember a point at which you thought to yourself, I'm, I'm gonna take this seriously now? At what point can you remember where you start to think that? I think the moment I started, you okay. know, I'm kind of, I'm the type of person who like to tackle things and then see them through completely, you know, until yeah. there's no, nowhere else to go. Nothing hot <laughs> No, it's like, if I'm gonna do it, it's all or nothing. Mm -hmm. um, so when I started, I was like, okay, let me see how far this can go. You know, um, not too many people from where I was from, you know, were professional dancers. And then once I started training in the city, I started to learn of the other dancers from um, Atlanta yeah. who became super influential to um, me wanting to continue to process the journey. Can you name some of those? Oh my God, people? absolutely. Chuck Maldonado, Don Draco Johnson, Kiki yeah. Eli. These were people from Atlanta you know, every time they came back, they showed so much love to the new kids coming up. Yeah. You know, it was always love, always, yeah. always, always love. And that meant so much, it still means so much to me now. Yeah. Um, so it was because of them actually how, Basically. okay, boom, you know, them saying, you can do this, you got this. Okay, I can't wait for y'all to move to LA. Yeah, yeah. Um, can't wait to see you soon. You know, all those little things helped. 100%. So you had mentors from quite mm -hmm. early on, which I think mm -hmm. is really, really important. Yeah.